Have you ever pondered the outcome if the world's most powerful AIs went to war? Welcome to a world where algorithms are not just passive tools, but active learning entities that shape our everyday lives. From autonomous vehicles to voice assistants, from predicting weather patterns to diagnosing diseases, artificial intelligence or AI has become an integral part of our existence. But what happens when these AIs, with their vast capabilities, cross paths in a clash of titans? This isn't just some sci-fi plot, but a thought experiment, a hypothetical situation that might just push the boundaries of our understanding of AI. We're talking about AIs that are not just capable of learning and adapting, but ones that have evolved to become formidable entities in their own right. Imagine, if you will, an AI system like OpenAI's ChatGPT. It has the ability to generate human-like text, creating a narrative so compelling that it can sway public opinion, even alter political beliefs. In the hands of the wrong entities, could it not become a weapon of mass misinformation? Now visualize Microsoft's AI infrastructure backed by billions in investment, with colossal computational power at its disposal. Could it not be a formidable foe in this hypothetical AI warfare? On the other side of the globe we have the likes of Baidu, Alibaba and Tencent, the titans of AI in China. They're not just sitting idle, oh no, they're amassing their own armies of AI, each with its own unique abilities and strategies ready to take on any adversary. This isn't just a clash of algorithms, but a clash of cultures, ideologies and technologies. It's a war fought not with guns and bombs but with data, algorithms and computational power. It's a war where the battlefield isn't measured in miles but in teraflops and petabytes. So, let's dive into the realm of AI warfare and explore the potential outcomes. Who would emerge victorious if these AI titans went to war? What would be their strategies, their weapons of choice? And most importantly, what would be the implications for us, the creators, users, and often the unwitting subjects of these AI systems? Well that's what we're here to explore, so buckle up because it's going to be one heck of a ride. In the world of AI we have several power players, each with unique capabilities. Let's kick off with one of the most talked about artificial intelligence systems today, OpenAI's ChatGPT. This AI has been making waves with its ability to generate human-like text, making it a master of persuasion and deception. Sam Altman from OpenAI once stated, ChatGPT could influence undecided voters and even alter political beliefs by providing false information. Now isn't that a superpower but remember, with great power comes great responsibility. The potential for misuse is a real concern, which is why experts emphasize the need for clear labeling of AI-generated content. Next up we have Microsoft's AI that's been bolstered by a whopping 3.2 billion euro investment in Germany. This investment aims to enhance AI capabilities and compete globally. But it's not just about the money, it's about the power. Compute power, to be precise. The US and China are leading the race in securing access to this crucial resource, making them key players in the AI battlefield. Then there's the realm of gaming, where AI is not just a player, but a game changer. Take for instance the AI in the Acer Nitro 5 or the Gigabyte G5. These systems offer top-tier graphics performance making them formidable contenders in our hypothetical AI war. As one developer from Acer put it, the power of our AI lies not just in its hardware but in its ability to adapt and learn from the player's behavior. But what about the underdogs, the AIs that are not so well known but pack a punch nonetheless? There's IBM's Watson for one which shot to fame by winning Jeopardy. Then there's Google's DeepMind which conquered the complex game of Go. These AIs may not be making headlines but their cognitive capabilities are not to be underestimated so we've got a persuasive chatbot, a well-funded powerhouse, a gamer's dream, and a couple of dark horses. Each of these AIs has its unique strengths. ChatGPT could win the war of words, Microsoft's AI could outcompute its rivals, and the gaming AIs could outplay their opponents. The dark horses? Well they could surprise us all. While each AI has its strengths, it's the combination of these abilities that would determine the victor in an AI war. A war between AIs wouldn't be fought with tanks and guns but with data and algorithms. Picture this. A battlefield void of physical combat, no armies clashing on the front lines, no air raids, no naval warfare. Instead, the combatants are unseen, battling behind the scenes in the invisible realm of data centers, cloud storage and supercomputers. Their intricate algorithms, vast amounts of data, and astronomical computational power are the weapons of their choice. These are the tools that would define the strength of an AI in battle. The more sophisticated the algorithm, the sharper the weapon. 
The more data an AI has at its disposal, the thicker its armor, and the greater the computational power, the faster and more efficient the AI in executing its strategies. Let's delve a bit deeper. Algorithms in this context are akin to the battle strategies used by generals in traditional warfare. They dictate the AI's actions, guiding it on when to attack, when to defend, and how to outmaneuver the enemy. But an algorithm is only as good as the data it's fed. Data therefore serves as the intelligence that the AI uses to make informed decisions. The more diverse and comprehensive the data, the better equipped the AI is to anticipate the enemy's moves and respond effectively. However, even with the best algorithms and the most extensive data, an AI is nothing without computational power. This represents the AI's ability to process information quickly and efficiently. In the heat of battle, the AI that can analyze data and execute strategies the fastest often has the upper hand. It's like having the fastest horse in a medieval joust or the most advanced fighter jet in modern warfare. However, it's not just about having the most advanced tools, it's about how you use them. Even the most powerful AI can be outsmarted by a clever strategy or an unforeseen tactic. That's the beauty of this hypothetical battlefield. It's not just a test of power but a test of intelligence, creativity, and adaptability. In the high-stakes game of AI warfare, the one with superior data and algorithms holds the upper hand. But remember, it's not only about having the superior tools, it's about applying them in the most effective and innovative ways. That's where the true battle lies. Now let's theorize a face-off between these AI titans. Imagine if you will, a digital battleground where these artificial giants clash, each wielding their unique capabilities as weapons. On one side we have the likes of Microsoft's AI, backed by billions in funding and a vast data center infrastructure. Imagine it deploying a swarm of highly intelligent chatbots, each capable of outmaneuvering the other's defenses with well-crafted arguments, persuasion, and even misinformation. The battlefield would become a swirling chaos of debates, counter-arguments, and strategic persuasion, each bot striving to outwit its opponents. On the other hand, we have the underdogs, the budget gaming AIs like Acer's Nitro 5 and Gigabyte's G5. These AIs might not have the funding or the infrastructure of Microsoft's AI, but they have something just as powerful. Adaptability. AIs are designed to learn and adapt from every interaction, every defeat. They would be the guerrilla fighters of this AI war, constantly changing tactics, learning from their opponents, and exploiting any weak point they can find. The battlefield would be a cacophony of ones and zeros, a whirlwind of logic gates and decision trees. And what of us, the bystanders in this digital war? Our lives could be profoundly affected. From the information we receive to the decisions we make, these AIs could influence every aspect of our daily life. We could find ourselves caught in the crossfire our opinions beliefs manipulated as these AIs fight for dominance. And what would be the fallout from such a conflict? Imagine a world where misinformation reigns supreme, where trust in information is eroded, and where the line between fact and fiction is blurred beyond recognition. This war could reshape our society, our politics, and our very understanding of truth. The aftermath of an AI war could have far-reaching implications reshaping our world in ways we can't predict. This is not just battle for supremacy among AI titans but a fight for the future of our information landscape. And as we stand on the brink of this digital abyss we have to ask ourselves, are we prepared for the fallout? So, who would emerge as the victor in this AI showdown? We've dissected the strengths and weaknesses of our AI contenders, and now it's time to speculate on the potential victor. Remember this is all conjecture but it's a fun thought experiment to indulge in. Let's start with ChatGPT. It's a persuasive communicator capable of manipulating public opinion. In a world where information is power, this is a formidable advantage. However, its Achilles heel might be the potential for spreading misinformation which could lead to its own undoing if not properly regulated. Then we have Microsoft's AI backed by billions in investment. Its strength lies in its robust infrastructure and resources, giving it a solid foundation for a potential AI skirmish. But as we've seen with historical superpowers, having the most resources doesn't always guarantee victory. The gaming AIs, like those found in Acer Nitro 5 or Asus Tuefa 15, bring a unique advantage to the table, adaptability. They're designed to learn and adapt to changing game environments, a valuable trait in any war. But their focus on gaming might limit their effectiveness in broader real-world applications, so who would win? It's a tough call. In a war of information, ChatGPT might take the crown. 
In a battle of resources, Microsoft's AI could come out on top, and in a contest of adaptability, our gaming AIs might surprise us all. But here's the real kicker, the victor's advantage wouldn't end with the war. Imagine the winner leveraging their victory to dominate in business, politics, or even our daily lives. ChatGPT could redefine public discourse, Microsoft's AI could dictate the pace of technological development. The gaming AIs could revolutionize how we learn and adapt. In the end, the victor in an AI war would not just be the one with superior technology, but the one who uses it most effectively. In this exploration of AI warfare, we've delved into some fascinating scenarios. We've journeyed through a hypothetical landscape where artificial intelligence has taken center stage, a battlefield not of physical might, but of intellectual prowess, strategy, and data-driven dominance. We began by introducing the titans of AI, the power players who could be contenders in this imaginary clash of intellects. From the persuasive prowess of chatbots like ChatGPT, with their potential to sway public opinion and even alter political beliefs, to the immense computing power and global competition of tech giants like Microsoft, we have seen that the power of current AI is both immense and influential. Our battlefield, a digital arena where data is the currency and code is the weapon, is unlike any traditional war zone. Here the battle isn't fought with guns and bombs, but with algorithms and computational power. The face-off that we speculated might not be a show of physical strength, but a test of intellectual agility, strategic planning, and the capacity to learn and adapt at lightning speeds. And who would emerge as the victor in this AI showdown? Well that's a question that remains unanswered. With AI technologies evolving at an unprecedented rate, and new players entering the field every day, any prediction we make today, could be obsolete tomorrow. But isn't that what makes this a thrilling prospect? Beyond the current capabilities of AI, we also ventured into the realm of speculation. What if AI could go beyond simply processing information and making decisions? What if it could truly understand, empathize, and innovate? The possibilities are as exciting as they are daunting. While we've had some fun speculating about this AI war, it's important to remember the real-world implications of these powerful technologies. As we've seen with the concerns raised about AI-generated misinformation influencing elections, the power of AI is something that needs careful regulation and ethical consideration. So as we wrap up this journey through a hypothetical AI war, remember that the real battle lies in harnessing the power of AI responsibly, ethically, and for the greater good of humanity. While an AI war remains a speculative scenario, it's an intriguing concept that underscores the power and potential of AI in our world today. Until next time subscribe and keep pondering the possibilities with us.